Crystals Simplified, The Guide to Spellcasting, Healing, Meditation, and Spiritual, Spiritual Well-Being by Isabella Ferrari. Ferrari. So, small little hardback um, thin book, but like look at. So, you're not getting a whole lot of chapters, but um, you get what it, what is a crystal, healing crystals. Um, the largest part is um, the properties, um, not properties, profiles um, of 50 different crystals. And the last chapter being the spells, rituals, and crystal grids. So you get um, difference between mineral, rock, crystal, gemstone, and then you get like little shape profiles. So egg, worry stone, double point. Um, like how to pick your crystal. So like the size of it, um, shape, color. So quick color correspondences. Um, but each person is going to have a different feeling of um, colors. Um, cleansing and care. So like um, smoke, snow, water, salt. Um, charging them, programming. Um, so, chapter two, healing. Um, chakra healing. So you get chakra profiles. Um, or healing. So, like a lot of um, the crystal books that I've read. Um, to bring in the chakra and or um, the aura into it. Um, so when you get to the profiles, you get like a little like image of the stone. Um, colors or origins, um, chakra elements, uh, magical attributes, tips, and um, some brief information about it. Well, Amethyst has a little bit more, but um, yeah, you don't get every single uh, computer is going, okay. Yeah, you don't get like every single like, um, I don't think you get like every single uh, type of crystal out there. You just get kind of like the more common ones that you would see. Um, but um, yeah, like there, as you can see, the, the crystals are like one right after the other. So like you're, you don't get like wasted space that some books may have but like you don't always um so that can be a pro and con for some people because like some people might want to have that extra space to put notes or something um here you have a hundred supplementary crystals so you're just basically getting more crystals and like um what they could be used for so like um dalmatian stone mental freedom warning uh, you before dangerous situations dissolving obsessive thoughts uh, lava rock storing energies until you need to use them absorbing negative energies and so and then when you get to the um Fourth chapter, so like typical kind of like ritual 
spell setup. So this one's for a prosperity spell jar. So you get an intro, what you need, and how to like set it up or do it. And so like, um, yeah, bad lighting, can't really see <laughs> properly. But uh, they're white, right on, right after each other. Love, so you get love candle spell, protect and cleanse your house spray spell. So again, white one right after the other. Um, not really a space for notes, but you could also transfer this or use another notebook uh, for reference. So, like the right, like the writing is pretty. Um, it's like not like intense or anything. And like uh, pretty easy to understand and like not talking down to you or anything. So it's just like here's the facts, here's the information type of thing. Um, under under 200 pages, like under like it's like 159, yeah, like 159 pages of like information, uh, small, like if you want like a smaller type of book to carry around or something, like if you're going to a crystal show or something. <laughs> uh, quick little reference type of book. Um, but yeah, crystals simplified, happy readings.